Alzheimer's is a slow, fatal disease of the brain affecting one in ten people over the age of 65. No one is immune. The disease comes on gradually as two abnormal protein fragments called plaques and tangles accumulate in the brain and kill brain cells. Merry Christmas. What is it? It's a present for you. <laughs> for me? For you. Oh my god! So you haven't looked at the vacuum cleaner in four years. Kai throws his temper tantrum when I take away his toothbrush. So dramatic. So Lynn, how much would you say that you think you're worth? Solid 13 cents. Now listen son, I know you're upset that you're grounded, but it's because you got in trouble at school, do you understand? Thank you. Do you understand me? Do you understand me? No, I... Hey Dad, you want to throw the football? Shut up, I'm watching the game. So let me get this straight. You're Asian, you're really good at math, and you're the number one kid in our school, right? And that you can. Tell her when to stop. I'm gonna let you tell her, okay? All right, good, good, good. You're good. Do not look away from the dog, okay? Go ahead and come a little bit closer. Okay, you're all right. All right. Okay. Think of your family who is not gonna want you to suffer. I think you should pet the dog. Babies aren't quite sure what happens to objects when they leave their sight. Sky's mom keeps disappearing and reappearing. Type A personality. Type B personality. In February 1999, four New York City police officers were on patrol in the Bronx when they saw a young black man standing on a stoop. They thought he looked suspicious. When they pulled over, he retreated into the doorway and began digging in his pocket. He kept digging as the police shouted at him to show his hands. A few seconds later, the man, Amadou Diallo, a 23-year-old immigrant from Guinea, was dead. His Type A personalities are very driven, they're very competitive against other people, including themselves, very ambitious, do not know how to play well, and take everything very seriously. Um, so they can learn, though, to reduce the tension in their life by changing their thinking and changing their behavior, ultimately changing their values. To watch the Shouldn't we be working on our final for math scores right now, guys? No. Lynn, how do you feel about your weight? I am so fat. I need to lose, like, 40 pounds. And how much do you have? I have a lot of it. Steven. Thanks. So first we're going to look at these two cups right here. Do you think there's the same amount of juice in this glass as there is in that glass? They're even. They're even? Okay. So we're going to take the juice from this glass and pour it into this one right here. Okay. 
Okay, so now we're going to look at this glass and that one. So do you think that there's more juice in this glass, more juice in this glass, or do you think that they have the same amount? Same amount. Okay, why do you think that they have the same amount? Hey, Lynn. Isn't it great being in the group with all the cool kids? Unlike Steven. Why can't we go get ice cream? Because I said so. That's why. Hey, boys and girls, puberty. It's a lot like having your brain taken over by a zombie virus. Your face breaks out. You start to smell weird. You're constantly exhausted, and you grow hair in... places. It may feel like you've turned into a zombie. But there's a silver lining. The exact same thing is happening to everyone around you! Lynn, you sure have had a lot of those crackers. Yeah, I'm going to the bathroom for like an hour now. Nothing weird there, right, Steven? I think that everyone in the world is good. I hate everyone. Thank you.